hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is Stella Simbi and if you're new you're welcome and please subscribe and if you're already subscribed but thank you so much for coming back you are the best so in today's video guys I'm going to show you how I did these two barbie ponytails on my short 4CA guys so let's get into the tutorial this hairstyle was uh, inspired by Nicki Minaj Barbie World hairstyle guys I was in love with those ponytails I was like I have to do this I have to do this so I started off by sectioning my hair into two and then I'm going to be using ISO plus styling gel and ISO plus hairline and edge holding gel so I'll be using both so I'm starting off by applying the styling gel and then I'm going to uh, apply all over my hair uh, the back, the front, the sides, everywhere and also apply it in the middle uh, and then I'm going to be using my Bristol brush to brush my hair and then after brushing the hair I'm going to tie with a scrunchie uh, and then I will also apply the SO Plus because this gel was not that thick it was not laying my hair like the way i wanted so that's why i used both this one and the iso plus so right here i'm just applying the iso plus with my uh edge brush and then i'm going to tie the hair again and after tying the hair i'm going to braid it down so after braiding the hair down i'm going to be doing my baby hairs and for the baby hairs i'm going to be using uh, the go to be glued gel in the yellow tube so the iso plus like i said before on my other videos it doesn't hold my hair because my hair is too thick so i decided to use this uh go to be gel and it holds my edges like guys if you have thick hair this gel is the best guys it's the best for holding the edges and i did not experience any flaking with it so that was a good thing. Yes, I'm going to spray this glamour spray on the hair because I want my hair to stay for quite some time. Uh, and the ISO Plus gels, I don't really trust them on my thick hair. So that's why I use glamour to make sure that everything is secure and stays in place. And after that, I'm going to tie my hair down for about an hour yeah for about an hour and then i'm going to remove uh the scarf if you can uh leave it uh, like that for longer but i didn't have that time to wait that long so that's why i did only an hour but you can leave it for longer so that your hair can dry completely but i didn't have that time so i'm going to be using this brazilian aka brazilian natural uh, and then I'm going to be using two bundles one on each side So I'm going to place my hair like that and I'm, then I'm going to take a bobby pin and then I'm going to secure the hair I'm not going to glue it or sew it. I'm just going to be using bobby pins and it was secure guys It was secure. It didn't go anywhere. It stayed in place So I'm just going to wrap around the hair uh, until the end then I'm going to take uh, the extra at the end of the bundle i'm going to take a small portion of hair and then i'm going to wrap it around the ponytail like this section your hair and then wrap it around to cover the weft of the bundle so after doing this i'm going to add more bobby pins to make sure that it is secure and it stays in place so if you want to sew it or glue it down you can go ahead and do that but i didn't want to do that i just thought the bobby pins were uh good enough and they were secure the ponytail stayed in place so you can do whichever way you feel comfortable and confident in so i'm going to be applying these bubble scrunchies and this is the whole point of the ponytails like i wanted the bigger ones like uh the ones nikki had but uh at my local beauty store they only had them in white so I decided to buy these smaller ones uh, because they had in different colors. So yeah, but I wanted the bigger ones like 
the pinks, the whites, the colorless, that uh, is what I wanted, but they didn't have those. So I had to work with what I had. So guys, this is the final look. I feel like a doll right now. <laughs> Do I look like a Barbie? <laughs> yeah guys so thank you so much for watching if you are new please subscribe and if you are already subscribed but thank you so much for always coming back thank you so much for the support don't forget to like share and drop your comment in the comment section and i will see you guys in my next tutorial goodbye thank you for watching